Breaking news overnight, at least 10 show horses died in a barn fire. It started around 9.30 last night at the horse barn at 44 B&B Stables Road in Fairview. That's where News 13's Megan Shearing is live right now. So, Megan, do investigators know what caused the fire? At this time, no, Victoria. Firefighters say this barn has been around for a number of years. They tell me it was packed full of hay and that the inside was made of wood. Therefore, this fire had a lot of fuel to go on. About uh, 30 feet flames coming through the roof. It was a fire that could be seen at least a mile away. Just ask Jeff McClure. I just sit on my front porch relaxing and I didn't really pay attention to the glow until I heard the uh, fire trucks and all coming up the road. And about the time they come around the corner, I heard a little bit of an explosion. What he was seeing was this horse barn on B&B Stables Road in Fairview. For unknown reasons, it caught fire. Our first arriving units uh, arrived on scene and, and uh, reported that uh, large amount of flame, heavy smoke. When the blaze broke out, more than two dozen show horses were trapped inside. It sounded like some kind of tank or something exploding. Firefighters were scrambling to put out the flames, but the intensity of the blaze was making it difficult. The Fairview Fire Department needed extra manpower. Something of this size, uh, you get firefighters overheated, stuff like that, so we've got to rotate them around. So we've got to have crews standing by to replace the ones when they, when they get overheated. And they also needed help getting water to the barn. We've got about uh, three, three engines dedicated right here at the scene. We've got another uh, engine or two that's relaying water to the scene, and we've probably got uh, eight or ten uh, large cata capacity tankers that's hauling water from the uh, from the hydrants and uh, the creeks here nearby. It would take almost 45 minutes for crews to get the fire under control. Uh, the roof collapsed in on top of everything in there. They're actually having to go and move things by hand and uh, move roofing tin, pieces of roofing, stuff like that. So uh, uh, we're going to be here for, for a pretty good while. But in the end, 30 horses ended up losing their lives. Now that was the initial report is that 30 horses had died in this fire, but actually I'm being told that it was only 10 horses that uh, were killed in this fire. Now two horses were able to escape. Firefighters uh, have been monitoring this fire all night. Uh, it, they're waiting for it actually to cool down before investigators can actually get into this uh, building to figure out what exactly sparked this blaze. And of course, we'll continue to follow this story and bring you any updates as soon as they become available. Reporting live in Fairview this morning, Megan Shearing, News 13.